what's going on? 1247, great one. As I always say, it's a great day to be a great gentleman. God, you know, be happy to be breathing. Be happy that you are uh, in the land of the living. Just be happy, gentlemen. Be happy that uh, that you made it to another day. Or you're going into another day. It doesn't matter. But gentlemen, check this out, man. Uh, as far as uh, all this game, listen. Gentlemen, I'm going to tell you this right now. If you are using game, Gentlemen, I'm gonna tell you right now, you are you are an ultimate loser. If are if you are using game to get at women, gentlemen, I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you, you are a straight up loser. I'm not gonna sugarcoat nothing. If you are using game, if you sitting here using listen to these guys and these PUA, this game coach and all that stuff, gentlemen, I'm telling you right now, you are a loser. I tell you gentlemen all the time You gentlemen need to have A Solomon like mindset You gentlemen should not Listen You should not be spitting any type of game To any type of female whatsoever You should not be spitting any type of game To any type of woman Whatsoever You need to be like Solomon This is why I talk about this productivity. See, bro, productivity, I keep saying it over and over again, productivity is what's going to get you the woman that you want. Because the woman that you want, especially if you're working hard and you're developing your building, you want a woman that's going to do this, that, that has the same mindset. But gentlemen, as soon as you start spitting game to these women, these women automatically know in their mind you're just trying to get some vagina. These women automatically know. Automatically. Does it have to be a thought? These women automatically know only thing you're trying to do is get some draws. That's it. Gentlemen, the gig is up, man. The cat is out the bag. Listen, these women, the only reason why these women entertain you is because you might you might look halfway decent. But these women know in the back of her mind, well, she's not even in the back of her mind. These women know in her mind, you, you come to spit to her, you're just trying to get some draws. The gentlemen, the game is, the, the, the gig is up. The gig is up. The gig is up. Oh, what do, what do you mean, 12? We, we, what are we supposed to be doing there? You're supposed to be working. You're supposed to be developing. That's what you're supposed to be doing. And the woman that you desire will, will, will offer her services to you, gentlemen. You gotta have that type of mindset. You're not supposed to be out here doing the jigaboo nonsense and out here hollering. Like I said again, let, let me holler at you. 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 All, that, all that dumb stuff, man. We're not doing that stuff no more. So we a new generation of we a new generation of sons, man. We not we not like we not like them old jokers, man. We're not out here. Just trying to smash this and smash that, man. It's, it's time to get to work. So, yeah, gentlemen, as of today, man, stop hollering at females, man. The females should be hollering at you. Women should be hollering and offering their services to you. Just like in, just like, just like Solomon. Solomon didn't holler at anybody. Everybody came towards Solomon. This is what a son does. People are attracted towards the light. People are supposed to be drawn to you, gentlemen. You're supposed to be on your mission. You know what I'm saying? If I see the sun up here, the sun has a course. The sun has a course. Every time I come outside, look, the sun is right there. The sun has its own course. The sun has its purpose. The sun has its, its a mission, a vision, an SOP. When I come outside, the sun right here has its own mission. You gentlemen need to be like this sun up here. You need to have your own mission. You need to come out here into this world and be about your purpose. I say it all the time, gentlemen. This is your purpose. This is your vision. This is your plan. This you carry this wherever you go. Wherever you go in life, you carry this with you. 
See, a man without purpose, a man without a plan, a man without a vision, gentlemen, you're useless. And these women know this. A man without a, a man without a purpose, a man without an SOP, standards, or operation, and procedure, and without a vision, gentlemen, you are worthless. All these women know this. I don't care how much money you got in the bank. I don't care. I don't care what, what type of car you're driving. Gentlemen, if you don't know where you're going, you are worthless to a female. And this is why a lot of you gentlemen are getting ran through because a lot of these women know that majority of 80% of you men don't don't know, don't have a clue on what you're doing. So yes, gentlemen, stop hollering at females starting the day. You gentlemen should be so busy about whatever your business is that women should be offering their services to you. You shouldn't be looking for help. Help should be looking for you. I'm going to say it again. You shouldn't be looking for the help. Help should be looking for you. But you got to be out here shining. This is what the uh, let your light so shine. Your productivity, your work, your creativity. Your impact on your society, that's the light that is shining that's coming from you. See, when people see you doing something, gentlemen, that's that's the light that's that the Bible talks about shining. Let your light so shine. Yes, gentlemen, your light is your creativity. Your light is your productivity. Your light is your impact on a certain society. That is your light. People are attracted towards your productivity, which equals the light. But gentlemen, if you sitting back in the cut chilling, nobody can see you. If you sitting back in the cut uh, with your mans and them, we sitting out here going to the clubs and popping bottles, doing all this stuff. Gentlemen, nobody, no, the, 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 the woman, the help that you desire can't see you because you, you look just like everybody else. That goes back to the being exclusive. Exclusive, once you become separated or exclusive, it comes from your productivity. Your productivity causes you to be exclusive. Productivity causes you to be exclusive. All right? Productivity causes you to be exclusive. I already said it, gentlemen. Productivity equals impact, equals exclus exclusivity, equals the value. But you gentlemen have to get to work. People have to see what you are doing people have to see what you are producing people have to see people have to hear something that separates you from all the all 80 percent of these men that's out here something has to separate you from 80 percent of men that's out here what's going to separate you gentlemen what is going to separate you you're going to be like everybody else you're going to be in the club you're going to be kicking it Lay back, popping bottles, hollering at Keisha and them. See, this is why these women treat you like a little boy. See, women try to sun you, they try to little boy you because you don't have a purpose. Women, women know when a man has a purpose because you know why? You're not going to be trying to holler at them. They're going to be trying to holler at you. See, this is what these women know. See, these women know in the back of her mind that, listen, this man is not supposed to be trying to talk to me. I'm supposed to be talking to him. A lot of you fellas ain't got the, a lot of you gentlemen ain't got the Solomon mindset. A lot of you gentlemen sitting up here, still, uh, uh, still, you know, uh, yo, I got, I got money and I got this and I got that. So you gentlemen haven't grown up yet. You haven't grown up yet. You still trying to do what your uncles and them did. You trying to do what your, 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 your big cousin and them did. And you, and you see what the results is of trying to be like big cousin and your uncle. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening in your community. Nothing's happening. A whole, bu a whole bunch of men walking around waiting to smash something. That's what's happening in the so-called community. The women have become the men. So these women can have, these women have come, they have become polyamorous now. So now these women are sitting up there with, with all these different, uh, all these different men having all these kids by all these different men. And she's drawing all she's drawing money from all your pockets. 
So women in the community have become the men. So you gentlemen got to switch the game up, gentlemen. It's, it's time to be, listen, it's time to be uh, with, with um, what Jesus is saying about it. It's time to be about your father's business. It's time to be about the business, gentlemen. We all have a purpose of why we exist. We all have something that we need to be doing. And hollering at Keisha and them just ain't what it is. It's not what you're here for. You hollering at Keisha shows you are weak. You are weak. And these women know this. Every time, listen, every time I go on YouTube and I see you gentlemen try to holler at these women, this is why these gentlemen, this is why these women try to little boy you. Every time you, you men try to holler at women, these women always are trying to little boy you every single time. Every single time these women trying to little boy you. I just seen one dude try to holler this one chick. Uh, 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 I guess he was in New Orleans. He was he was trying to holler old girl in a shopping center, and she gets she was giving him all types of attitude. Cause why? She knows that. Listen, you trying to holler at her? It's only one thing. You trying to get some draws, man. These women know you just trying to get some draws. These women know you not trying to build nothing. These women know straight up and down. You just trying to get some draws like the man before you. These women know this, man. You trying to come off like I'm trying to get to know you. Gentlemen, these women know you're not trying to get to know them. You just trying to, you just trying to beat it up. These women know that. The last thing on your mind is trying to build something. The only thing you're trying to do is trying to get some draws. That's it. You trying to get some draws and she's trying to get your resources. Come on, gentlemen. You don't come on, man. We're gonna keep playing these games. So I don't even point the women at the I don't I don't put the point the finger at the women no more. It's no point of keep pointing the female, keep pointing the finger at the female, gentlemen. It's all on you. But then here, here we go once again. You jump, then you complain, all oh, this, all oh, that, all oh, this, all oh, that. Come on, gentlemen. You bunch of let me be honest. A lot of you I'm gonna say it again, a lot of you gentlemen. 80% of you gentlemen in the community are just a bunch of bitches, man. Let's be, let's let's get real honest. 80% of y'all are just a bunch of bitches. I'm sorry I had to get a little, little raw with it, but I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, man. I gotta I get I gotta get raw. Just a bunch of big bitches. The men have become the women, and the women have become the men in the community. But instead of switching gears up and doing things different, you gentlemen complain that, oh, she, oh, Sheila wants some, uh, anyways, I'm not going to keep going, going on with that. But gentlemen, stop trying to holler. As this, th listen, as uh, as of today, as you hear this from me, I'm doing the same thing. Gentlemen, I'm not going to holler at a single female, bro. I'm done. What I'm going to do is let my light shine, let my product productivity shine, let my impact shine. So the woman that I need, that's gonna help me get to, that's gonna help, that's gonna, that's gonna roll up her sleeves. Does she see that I'm working? So anything that comes to me has to be, have to have her sleeves rolled up because, listen, me taking you to the movies and me taking you out to eat this, that, and the third. That's that, that. Listen, that's that, that's dead now. That's dead for me. Taking you out here and trying to be romantic. I already told you, gentlemen, about that romance nonsense. Romance is for, for, for weak men. Men that don't have purpose, romance. Men, men that don't have a vision, romance. Men that don't have an SOP, standards of operations and procedure. That's what that's what uh, romance is for. Men that don't have any vision, any 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 direction where they're going. Romance is a is a basic it's like a cop out. It's a smoke screen. And these women that have caught on to your games, gentlemen. These women know you're trying to romance them. These women know you ain't got no damn, no, no, no damn direction. You, you romancing the females that 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 shows to her in her mind you ain't got no damn direction, and you and you uh, and it's open season for you. She gonna drain you dry because you you sitting up here with no direction, but you trying to be romantic. I'm gonna say this again, romance. I ain't gonna say, I ain't gonna say it like that. Romantic are for men. Who don't have vision? Who don't have? Who haven't discovered a purpose? Who don't have an SOP? Who don't have anything? This is what uh, men that use uh, romance. Because men that listen, men that are driven, 
men that have a purpose and the SOP and the, and the vision, they're not they're not romantic because they're doing things. See, women don't come to uh, Bill Gates' wife. Bill Gates' wife uh, don't come to him talking about, hey, take me out to the movies, this, that, and don't know. Bill Gates is out here doing what he needs to do. She comes, she conforms to his program. He don't conform to her. All this romance. Come on, gentlemen. Spitting game is romance, so gentlemen has to die like today. Get to work. Get to work. Stop spitting game. Nobody cares about the game you spitting. All you gentlemen spitting games. Are you serious right now? And over and over again, I keep watching YouTube and TikTok. These women know that you gentlemen spit in game. These women, only thing these women know, you just trying to get some draws. These women know, gentlemen, these women know the game. You gentlemen have not switched it up. The only reason why she's going to give you some airplay is because it depends on the way you look. These women are supposed to chase you. You're not supposed to chase no woman. I don't care. He who finds a wife. Well, finding a wife is not chasing after one. There's a difference. You're not supposed to chase a female to find something. That doesn't make sense. You chase a woman down to find a wife? No, gentlemen. That's what the hell? If you're on a journey, and on this journey, like, like, like I, I gave an analogy. Listen, if I'm going to, like, if my parents... Send me to the corner store when I was little. I used to go to the corner store that was like four or five blocks away, right? Go to the corner store and get a blah, 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 right? So I'm walking to the store. On my way to the store, I find $100. Now, did I go out the house to find that $100? Did I go chasing after this $100? Or was I on my way to a destination? And on my way to a destination, I found something. That's how it's supposed to work, gentlemen. You don't chase to find. It doesn't make sense. You don't chase a female to find a wife. It doesn't work like that. You're working ass backwards. You're supposed to be in the direction, just like the sun. The sun has a direction. The sun has a course. Just like that sun, just like me. I have a course. I got things I need to be doing. I got things I need to be creating. I'm doing, I'm doing that. I'm doing that now. Creating this, creating that, creating platforms. I'm doing that right now, gentlemen. I, I'm, I have a course. I have a course. Just like this sun has a course. You need to have a course too. You need to have purpose. SOP and the vision. Gentlemen, you need to have this already established. To find, to find the so-called helper that you need. I don't search. I don't. I don't have to search to find. I don't have to chase to find, gentlemen. Neither do you. You don't have to search. You don't have to chase to find whatever you, whatever it is that you're trying to find. Just like the corner store, gentlemen. You need to have a purpose and a vision. You need to be going forth, doing the things that you need to do. And on your journey to whatever it is that you're that, that you're developing, doing this, you will find, or hell, she will find you. You're the train. You're the conductor and you're the train. If she wants to jump on the train, listen, I'm heading in this direction. This is the way I'm headed. If you want to be on my program, then listen, hey, boom, boom, and boom. That's what I keep telling you, gentlemen. Stop chasing. You don't chase to find. You don't search to find. You need to be in a direction. You need to be, you need to be set forth and whatever it is that you're trying to do in life. You need to move forward. And the one that's supposed to that's that's supposed to be rocking with you, you will find her in your journey. This is your journey. She's your helper. I go on and say once again, you gentlemen trying to do this romance. I'm telling you, gentlemen, it's open season for you. These women know that any man that's romantic don't have a vision. You're not a real man if you don't have a vision, and that you're not executing. If a man is not executing his his uh, his goals and his dreams, gentlemen, you're not a real man. These women know this. These women know this. You gentlemen out here playing playing patty cake. 
These women know you gentlemen in the club. These gentlemen, oh yo 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 yo, all that all that you're herb. No, when I'm you know, from New York, herb. All that all that all them dumb noises you make. These women know you're not serious, man. This is why these women go for the so-called dope boys and the, and the and the drug dealers and all that. Cause these these listen, these dudes have a purpose. These scammers and this that and the third. Cause these women know these men have a purpose. These men that scamming and drug dealing, they not out here chasing after Keisha and LaRonda all day. They got purpose. Listen, I got to make this money. I got to do X, Y, and Z. Boo -boo. I got to make boss moves, this, that, and the third. I ain't got time to be hollering at these, these, old, these old females. If anything, it's the other way around. You see females always trying to holler at the so-called drug dealers. Because these men are, are, are they, I mean, the, the, the purpose is jacked up. The vision is jacked up, but guess what? They 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 bought their business. But here you good guys go. You guys do the opposite. You guys sit there and flowers and and chocolates and all that stuff, gentlemen. That shows that to me, I'm just gonna be honest, that shows weakness, man. That shows weakness. Flowers, cookies, candies, and all this other stuff, and trying to get the the I mean, gentlemen, you are trying to get an affection of a woman. So right now. You just put her in the masculine um, position. You doing all this stuff for her puts her in the masculine position. Okay. You gentlemen trying to show affection and all this stuff and trying to date and do, just do that, this, that, and the third. Gentlemen, you have put the woman in the masculine role. When you need to be like Solomon. Solomon, it was the other way around. Women were trying to show affectionate towards him because he was about his business. He was about his creation. He was about his, his manifestation. He was about, he was a visionary. He was a builder. He was all types of things. So women were trying to get his affection. They were bringing, shoot, you had all, listen, go, go read. Women were bringing gifts to him. Trying to show their affection to him because they wanted to be on his team. Solomon wasn't going around to these different women, giving her this and giving her that and giving. Come on, man. Oh, let, let me take you to let me take you to the to the to the show today. No, man. He was he had he had work to do. He had work to do. Just like you gentlemen, you gentlemen have work to do. You gentlemen got so many things in your head, but you you said you afraid of. You afraid of this and you afraid of what my mama and my daddy and my cousin's gonna think? Gentlemen, who gives a F no more, man? You gentlemen exist for a reason. This come on, gentlemen. Hundred listen, over hundred million sperm cells a man produces every single day. And you're here. You think it's a coincidence that you're here? There's over 130 men over over 130 million, million different versions of you that could have came through, but you're here. And your gentleman, you gonna waste it on 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 trying to chase after booty and titties all day? But that's the mindset of the community. That's a mindset of a parasite. See, lose. I'll tell you again. Losers don't have visions. I'll say that again. Losers don't have vision. Losers don't have direction. Loser doesn't have a, a, a SOP, a standard of operate, operating operations and procedures. Losers don't have these things already in place. Losers don't have it. Know what losers do? Losers out here chilling. Losers exist all day. Existing to a loser, that's that's the that's the uh that's what a loser wants to do, just exist. Loser is just a parasite. They, they latch on to people. They get to a certain destination and they just stay there for it for, for decades upon decades upon decades. That's what losers do. And losers will tell you, gentlemen, you don't have to work hard. You don't have to be healthy. You don't have to be smart. You can just be out here and just beg and plead and and, and pray, to, pray to some white man in the sky and somebody's going to save you. This is what losers think, gentlemen. This is what a lot of people in your so-called community think, gentlemen. There's a bunch of losers, man. I don't care who I offend. It's just what it is. Gentlemen, you're not a loser. You have work to do. Stop spitting game. Stop spitting this, this, 
This whole flim flam stuff you're doing. Gentlemen, stop spitting, period. Get to work. Get to work. Like I said in the beginning, gentlemen, 2022, shut the F up, move forward, gentlemen. All I'm saying is get to work. Stop spitting, gang. Have a mindset of Solomon. Get to work. Women should be offering their, their services to you. You should not be chasing after no female. Females should be coming and giving gifts to you because she want to be a part of your team. You shouldn't have to you shouldn't have to be trying to take a female to the movies. But once again, this is not what's being said in the so-called community top, because the only thing they want you to do is do the guy is do the damn genuine all day. Riding my pony, all that dumb stuff. This is what the community top wants you to do. And why they keep sucking you man dry. You sitting out here skeeting up all, all, all these bone quiches, man. You getting sucked dry. I'm telling you, gentlemen, break 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 away from the hypnosis, man. Break away from the hypnosis and get to work. Stop spitting and start building. Stop spitting. I'm going to say it again. Stop spitting game and start building a, a, a legacy. Not only for, for your future children, if you got kids, or for build it for, for the uh, or create the reality that you desire. Create platforms for, for, for generations after us. It's not for me and mine. Listen, man, listen. Hopefully, I can make an impact on the whole, whole society that whatever my dream is can pass on from the next generation to the next generation to the next generation. This is what everybody else does. As I look around and see all these different stores around me, I see I see generational, I see generational wealth. All these different clothing stores and movie theater, Starbucks. I mean, hell, man, you got you got generational platforms that can be passed down for generation after generation, gentlemen. But you're not going to build that that legacy if you keep spitting game to bone quiches. It's not going to happen. You shouldn't even be looking at bone quiches, but that's a whole nother blog I'll probably make one day <laughs> yeah gentlemen get to work get to work you gentlemen see listen I'm, I'm, I'm keep showing you different these different women gentlemen I'm keep showing these, diff these different women I'm not once again I'm not putting no women on the pedestal but the women that I'm showing you gentlemen you need these type of women on your team man I need royalty man I need royalty I, I listen I can't do this sexy no more the sexy is cool but I need I need royalty now when I step out here, well, listen, when I step out here, my wives, z, plural, yes. Gentlemen, I need to step out here with, with uh, I, need, I need some respect, man. Same thing you gentlemen. Gentlemen, stop chasing, chasing, stop chasing women, man. It's a wrap. I'm going to say it again. Every time you chase a woman, she knows you. She Listen, you chase after a woman, you spit game to a woman, gentlemen, you already lost. You put, listen, you take, you trying to spit game to a woman shows that she has dominance and dominion over you automatically. I don't care what your uncle told you. I don't care what your father and grandfather. You spitting at a woman shows that you are not dominant. She is the dominant one because you are you are offering your services. You are literally coming out your way to come talk to her. No, she's supposed to come out her way to come talk to you. See, nobody's going to tell you this in your community because they want to keep sucking you dry. That's cool because 12 is going to tell you that you gentlemen need to be out here. These women need to holler at you. You don't need to holler at no female whatsoever. As soon as you say, yo, what's up? Hey, ma, and all this dumb stuff y'all saying, gentlemen, you've already given her the dominance. She's already dominant. She's already dominant. You hollering, you spitting game to a female is is, is already you you were already lost. You already set the precedence for your so-called relationship, whatever situation you gonna have. You gave her, you just gave her the keys to the to the so-called kingdom. You just gave her the keys to the car. You told her, listen, drive wherever you go, I'm gonna follow. Gentlemen, don't do that. I'm trying to save you. I'm trying to save you money, resources. I'm trying to save you, gentlemen. Stop spitting game to these to these women. She comes to you. She 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 should be offering herself to you, not the other way around. But anyways, man, like, share, and subscribe. Please hit the cash up and donate if you don't mind. Have a good one. Peace.